Hey, what's up everyone? It's Barbarisi from the Bronx. I'm in the Bronx right now. I'm behind an abandoned building because I had to use the bathroom. You know I carry this whole thing of water with me. So when I gotta go, I gotta go, guys. Um, I made a video this morning, but guys, my phone is not working correctly. And I made a, uh, a video sending condolences to Jessie Dunn and her family. Jesse, you know, me and you just started really hooking up and reaching out to each other. And there's a reason for everything because God knows everything. Um, and I'm so sincerely sorry about your brother. I can totally understand what that is like, even though my brother was older than me. I'm the youngest out of four kids, but nevertheless. My brother died four years ago of small cell carcinoma and I watched him dwindle down to basically nothing. And I just wanna tell you that I am here for you if you need. And uh, me and Tito are very, very sorrowful for you. You know, that is not easy to go through losing a family member, especially at this time. Um, hi B. hello. Hello, B. And I just, I feel really, really bad. B was just flying by my head. I thought it was going to land on me, but not to change the subject, because that would be really inappropriate. Um, my mind just, I think of so many different things at once, so I apologize for that. You know, I don't want people th to think that I'm being rude. But Jesse, I really, really am very, very, very sorry. I am so so sorry you know i feel really bad when i seen first of all when i seen the post i had i don't go on facebook that much honestly guys i am never really been i tried facebook my nephews made an account for me like over 10 years ago um but i really barely used it and then last year around april um I posted a picture and I just seen everybody like, oh my God, you know, where, I mean, some family members that I was, you know, in touch with as a child, like, oh, your son's so cute, blah, blah, blah. And it was a nice feeling to get in contact with your family. I'm not gonna lie, it was really nice. So I started posting pictures, but then what I noticed was, is that it just wasn't me. Um, I still do it once in a while, me and the baby and sometimes Tito. You know, sometimes I'll look on and see what's going on. But honestly, to tell the truth, I'm not a big social media person. I never have been. So, um, when Jesse sent me a friend request, I was like, you know what? I was like, I think Jesse's giving me inspiration. I said, I said, and that's the truth. And I started to go on there a little bit more. And then she said, oh, I'm going live. And that's the night I went on her live and I had a wonderful time. And the next day I went on in the evening. First I checked to see if she put any videos up and I didn't, I saw a small video about the boss's birthday party. And then I seen that post later on in the day and I was like, oh my God. I said, first I saw the pictures, I didn't, Sometimes it's my fault. I don't read everything that I should. I just see pictures and I was like, oh, you know, beautiful family pictures. Okay. Next thing I know, I'm reading it and I see that, you know, it says the brother passed, her brother passed away. And I was like, oh my God. I said, no way, Jesse. I felt, you see how this phone is doing weird stuff? Do you see that guys? This iPhone is no good. It's making rainbows. Do you see that when the light hits? Look at that. It's totally making me look weird. Anyway, I don't care about that. I'm just saying if, if you notice the weird duration of colors going on, it's not me. It's my phone. I'm trying to get my backpack on and I'm going to go to the Dollar Tree right now. See, you got Halloween stuff up and then I'm going to meet Tito at the park. But um, like I said, I was reading her post. And I said, oh my God, no, I, I, I couldn't believe it. I was in shock, you know, I really, I didn't, I knew she had a brother. I knew you had a brother, Jesse, if you are watching this, but I didn't know he was younger than you, you know? Um, and it's just, it's devastating whether he was older or, or, or younger. 
it is so hard, especially like I said, at this point in time, during everything that is happening and keeping strong, staying sober, staying clean, which I know you're still gonna continue to do because you're strong, you're a warrior, 